Hello, everyone. This is Johnny. I'm a product manager in Sunkit Industry. In this video, I will introduce our new mental theory design guide for mental theory. So, let me switch to my screen and start my sharing. So, this is our new mental theory design guide. And uh, I just pick up the mental theory in part. For the full mental theory in design guide, if you have interest, you can download it from our official website. In this video, I will focus on the mental theory design guide. So, our mental theory design guide is divided in several parts. In the left page, we focused on the materials and the design, the drawing of the design and also the groove finish. In the right of the page, we focus on the size, include the dimension of the groove and the seal. And also we provide some refer performance data for your reference. So for the first, for the page in the left, in the, in the left hand, you can check some common materials, either for the gasket or for the planting. All these materials, like alloying 718 and the printing options like silver, are very common for all other customers. We have this, uh, we have these materials in stock, and if you choose this material, we can deliver the products to you very fast. And uh, normally it, it takes three or four weeks. If you order some other materials, some, some material is rarely used, then it uh, takes longer time. Uh, so I hope you understand that because we need to order the material from our supplier. So the next section of the design guide is about the groove and the seal design and uh, it's, uh, it's rejoined for the typical mental steering groove for the internal pressure and uh, you can check the DG, the WG and the radius and also the, the clearance. Then you can, we present two formula for you to, to calculate the, dam, the diameter of the mental steering internal pressure and also the groove diameter. Then in the end of the left page, we present you the groove finish recommendation. For some customers, we found that uh, after the customer installed the uh, mental serine, there may be some uh, little leakage. After we check the groove, af after we check the application, after we check the deployment, we found that most of the leakage is caused by the, the groove finish, which means that the, uh, the user didn't um, polish the groove very well. So in this table, we specially um, present our recommendations for you to polish your groove so that uh, uh, you can achieve your target ceiling effect. Then in the right hand of the page, uh, you will see a table. Then the table will include the groove dim dimension, the seal dimension. So first of, uh, of all, you can roughly estimate um, how large is your groove, uh, is, is, uh, how, how large is the groove. Then you can pick up the actual section of the, uh, of the metal steering. After that, you can go to the left section, uh, section of the table, then you, you can check the groove dimension and the, the dimension like uh, the groove diameter range, the groove depth range, and the white and the west groove and the west of the groove. All this, all this, that, uh, all this dimension is very essential to, uh, to 
deploy a mental seal and to achieve your target mental seal uh, saving effect. So these are the range of the diameter you can check if the dam you can you can check you can roughly estimate the diameter of your groove and you select the the according um a depth of the of the groove. Then you need to uh, s uh, select the, the the specific mental theory for your application. After that, you can refer the performance data. As you may know, right, the performance data is based on our test environment. So if you have a uh, have a different application, and I mean that uh, your hardware is different with with us, and your your finish is different with us, so you will get a, a different performance. Um, after you deploy the mental theory, it's it, it totally make, makes sense. So the data the, the, the data here is just for your reference. Uh, I mean the performance data here. Then in the end of the right in in a, in, a, in a right page, you can see the typical applications. So for mental theory, uh, can be applied in aerospace, oil and gas industrial, and the in injection section, uh, in injection systems. It's it's very common. And, and for mental theory, <clears throat> and also for the hard hard mode, hard mode, and some uh, and some something like this, you can always check this uh, li li the list here, the applications here to to uh, to, to, to to check out if you can apply a mental theory. If you are not sure if you if a mental theory can be applied in your application, you can always. Check with our support. Then the next page is about the mental theory for an external pressure. The difference between external pressure and the internal pressure is a uh, is for a groove. The, the pressure is, is either come come from inside or from outside. So the groove design will be totally different. And uh, we um, specifically uh, uh, present a new groove and groove is a join for your reference. You can also use the formula, the two formulas to calculate the sale and to calculate the groove size. Then, and in the end of the page, we also present the groove finish recommendations. So, and these are the, and these are the same as the mental theory internal pressure. And, and uh, in the in the right hand of the page, you will also see a table. The table is um, mostly sim similar with uh, the internal pressure, so you can refer to you can refer the table, and the same way as um, internal pressure. Then to pick up to select your your uh, your uh, your mental seal mental theory, and also design your groove. Then we also present the, the typical application questions for your reference. So these are the uh, two pages uh, specifically for mental theory. If you have any um, problem or if, or if you have any questions, you can connect with me. And uh, if you like our video, you think our video is useful, please like our video and uh, you can also subscribe our channel. I will see you in our next video. Bye.